I'm often approached about what to do for hair loss. And not every patient is necessarily a surgical candidate. Most patients are candidates for non-surgical treatment, but I have to go back to what's the cause. Figuring out the cause requires doing a scalp biopsy, and then we can determine that, for example, they may have a scarring alopecia, or they may have a reason uh, that they can't have surgery because it won't improve their situation. The hair, the hair will continue to fall out in spite of what we do. And, th and to those patients, there are some non-surgical treatment options. Um, but the key is to um, try to figure out what the cause is. And in most cases, in men, when we're dealing with a hormonal-related hair loss, an androgenic loss, or in women uh, as well that have patterned losses, those are amenable to surgical intervention. You can do both surgical and non-surgical things, but we have to determine what the cause is. The largest category of hair loss is treatable surgically, and it is with our surgical interventions that we get our best results for sure.